found out you cannot put incel in the title of any stream on Twitch. Why? What group is being repressed? Go ahead, raise your hands. We know who you are. You're the free stellar babe crew who decided you would claim some sort of victory that they secretly added some suits. Is this what you all were losing your goddamn minds about? Really? 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 You guys are fucking loser hers. I don't even remember what I was doing, but yeah, apparently they they put the suits in and some some fucking dorks were okay, we came from that way. We're like, "Hey, you said we would never win. Looks like we won." And I'm like, "I said incels would never win, and you just motherfucking You just fucking <laughs> Comedy, humor, irony, lost on no one. Is 300 pounds, is on computer in mom's basement, shitting themselves, playing Stellar Blade. Uh, Wash dad is at the dinner table with his family, his girlfriend, his child, in the house he owns. Yeah, man, you guys, you you won, man. You got your 14-year-old naked Korean girl in a video game. Like, you definitely, on your next first date, which I'm giving you a lot of credit, assuming you'd get that far. But on your next first date, just at the beginning of the date, can you do me a favor? Tell your date ab about all this Stellar Blade stuff. Just tell them and tell them what side you're on. Just do it. Just do it. Uh, tweet it at me. You doing it. See if you can record it. Honestly, that would be the funniest thing ever. And you would be the one cool incel in my book. Wait, what do I have to do? What? What do I do? Oh, man. Folks, it's been like weeks. Which, by the way, this game is not grabbing me. Oh, okay. I just haven't wanted to play lately. Lately, it is hard for me to put down Warhammer Bolt Gun. What else? Oh, the fucking... Uh, the Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. Oh, my God. Folks, we're going to have another remake in the game of the year conversation. That game's taking a lot of my time. I'm doing the Final Fantasy 16, the final DLC. RoboQuest, RoboQuest, RoboQuest. As well. But yeah, congrats. You guys got your uh your your naked teenage Korean lady in a video game. Um you should tell your parents that at the dinner table too. I'd just be interested. Listen, man, have your weird kinks, but be quiet about them. Go in the corner. Have shame. The fact that y'all got made fun of, okay, which you all said it was mostly about the blood and gore, and they didn't add back the blood and gore, but uh, everyone's like, ah, ha, ha, we want. Like, people were responding to, like, three-week-old threads or monthly threads. And, like, episodes of this, which came out a while ago. And I'm like, wow. Some dude argued with me for a while and then was like, why do you even care, man? Why are you still arguing? And I'm like, you're, you're, you're on my channel. <laughs> it's mine. It's, it's mine. Hi. Also, comments drive up the algorithm. Even if you've left a hateful comment. Thank you! Where the fuck am I supposed to go? This, something over here looked important. Okay, no, that did not look important. Another guy tried earnestly debating me, which I'm not I'm not on debate team. This isn't a mock trial. Okay, like the one the guy who works at IKEA said. 
then die. <laughs> what do you want me to do? I'm not on debate team. This isn't mock trial. Oh, this is this what I came down here for? Leaves comment on my channel. Hey, why is this guy responding? <laughs> and then a lot of people were like, how dare you attack someone's character? By the way, when calling them incels, I've realized none of them deny it. I think one guy was like, I, I have a kid. And I was like, all right, fair. Okay, we'd call that proof. Do I have to find some power source? Is that what I missed? See, I remember the rules a little bit. Where, where though? Oh, it's this thing. Right? No? Why are you a red glowing light with a door? What do I... Just what do I do? They're like This is why, like, all those times I was like, oh, maybe we should play Stellar Blade. And I was like, eh. Listen, there's only... I'm not saying the Elden Ring from software way of telling stories is wrong. I just don't like it. Just straight up, I'm going to be honest. Like, I just I don't like it. All right, this is obviously a dead end. Okay, I get it. Like, a lot of you really get, like, your boners off on that type of storytelling. Like, you... You think, like, it means something. Like, you think it's deeper than it is. It's just them putting the story into text. That's it. Rather than tell it through cutscenes, it's mostly you putting pieces together. Which, let's be honest, we all go to that one YouTube guy's channel who connects it all, and then we go, Oh! Listen, it's cool if that's his thing and that's the thing you guys are into. Like, it's fine. I, I just, I, I don't like it. I like to know what's going on. I like to be in the story. All this talk of, what is, what is the word everyone uses way too much? My, uh, my immersion. To me, nothing's just more immersing than a really good story. It has nothing to do with the environments. To me, it's it's what's the story? Like, how can I get into this? And it can be childish, too. Ratchet and Clank Rift Apart has a great story. I loved that shit. I feel like they definitely pulled that from, like, Marvel multiverse thing. But, oh, god damn it. Like that's what that's what gets me. Oh, I gotta remember that dashing move. I fucking keep unlocking it and I don't use it. All right, where are we going, Stellar Babe? Don't worry, guys. This is gonna come to PC, and there will only be four billion mods that make her nude. Oh, I get it. <laughs> Oops, sorry. I'm in combat. The hell I am. Yeah, you can't you can't defeat Stellar Babe. I'm Stellar Babe. Oh, all the incels are going to dislike the video. Oh no. You got to stop thinking Twitter's real life. Let me tell you, like, 99% of the people that were hyped for this and playing it were not a part of that crew. <laughs> like, oops. It was definitely a minority. <sighs> oh, it is cold ones o'clock. Nice, fresh, white claw. Hell Yeah. Why is it a thing too? Are we are we still making fun of people that drink white claws? Why? What? Literally, some dude at work last week. We had like a meeting on Friday, which is a sin. Stop doing it, uh, stupid people. Oh no. As I die. Oh, 
I was like, what the fuck? Like, what do you drink? Like, what? who cares? Who cares what someone else drinks? All right. Her, like, ginormous ass just kept the momentum. I appreciate a ginormous ass. I don't play a game because of ginormous ass. Oh, my God. She almost did it again. Use stories to emerge. Immerse. Oh, the white clothing. He, and he goes, I drink Coors. And I'm like, that fucking joke writes itself. No! I thought... I thought fucking X... I like forgot how to play, folks. I'm sorry. All right, well... Is this the Stellar Blade finale? <laughs> this game does need to start making me interested, like, soon. Uh. <sighs> oh, I had to hold the joystick. Oh, not, not intuitive at all. Oh, I'm sure it's not a bad thing that I used two of those already. I cannot stand the fact that you have to hit R2 to pick things up. Why? Why? What game does that? Hey, back on the way. B most beer is like 3%. So, like, what the fuck? White Claws are all 5, and, and they make a surge that's 8. So is, isn't the person drinking the less alcoholic beverage The you know... The less masculine one. I don't get it. It's all about tequilas and white claws, folks. It's the only thing that don't give me a goddamn stomach ache now. I'm old. I'm in my late thirties officially. And I've I've done sex, so I'm not a part of the stellar the free stellar blade crew. I like don't know who to make fun of more. The people who think drinking beer is like this great thing, or the, the people who got mad Korean teenager wasn't more naked in video game. You guys are really that's that's really a test there <laughs> of who can be stupider more stupid I did not come here for a chest hey man they're giving you the story and all the text you're just skipping it very true. How astute. <laughs> I got nothing for you, folks. Oh, come on, man. Even Elden Ring would have let me fucking attempt it. My immersion! I don't know. This is a brand new IP. Would, like, one fucking cutscene have not <laughs> been... Nice. Oh, good. I want all that to be saved. Did I earn any SP? God damn it, I didn't earn any SP. Our Super Mario and the Thousand Year Door... It'll start soon. I I'm playing through that one. I really battle in my mind with doing that sometimes... But I'm like, hold on, I'm going to defeat these guys first. Because I think it's fun to put my general first reactions to stuff. Instead of like, I'm seeing it for the second time. Like, you guys, you guys get my first reactions, and, and I kind of like that. Also, though, I, I gotta remember, it's just a fucking hobby. It's not that serious, and I want to play it first. And Paper Mario and the Thousand Year Door remake uh, has you do four files to one profile, so I can just play a, 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 another one. 
for you guys. It'll actually help, too, in the long run, because then I'll know what to do. Like, it's crazy. It's it's. This will go down as probably my favorite Paper Mario ever, the Thousand Year Door remake. I really liked it on the GameCube, and I remember liking it more than the Paper Mario 64. But, like, I don't remember it. Like, I remember every part of the Paper Mario 64 game, every part. I remember next to nothing about the Thousand Year Door. Like once, once I defeated Hooktail, I was like, "All right, that's about what I remember." Uh, dive, 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 Stellar Blade. Hello, yes, <laughs> my pretty Stellar Blade. Dance, my Korean video game girl doll. I loved the one guy, what, what's his name, David Jaffe, the uh, God of War guy, and he was like, <laughs> he made a reaction video because some fucking engagement bait console warring idiot was like, it was a girl too, and she was like, because he made a tweet about like, aren't you the guys always pretending to be hyper masculine all the time, and you're mad about a certain way you can dress your little video game girl doll, hee <laughs> hee, something like that, and she was like, is he trying to say that really that the incels or that the masculine men are probably incels and that it's a stupid argument and everyone on the... He, she like went on this like matter of fact rant and the, his only reaction was after she finished, he's like, does he mean these people actually suck? And he just at the very end, he goes, yeah, yes. And the video ends. It's It's like perfect. And I don't agree with that guy all the time. He has some boneheaded takes, too, sometimes. <laughs> Although I can't, I can't think of any. <laughs> I'm trying to... I've definitely disagreed with him on some things. Oh, his, uh... His whole thing with Kratos, like, Batman's been the same for 75 years, and he never got character development, and which is wrong, by the way. Are you kidding me? Every Batman's a little different, but come on. Batman doesn't have character development. All, all of them do in their own kind of way. Especially fucking Christopher Nolan's version, man. Are you kidding me? That guy didn't get character development? It was a weird, dumb thing to say. He basically just was saying he didn't he didn't like the new Kratos. Like Kratos wasn't meant to be a character that needed to be redeemed yada yada yada. He just wanted to kill shit. Yeah, man, that gets a bo boring after a while like all of the God of War games are on PS5 and I am tempted to play none of them. The first one is literally the only one I've beaten. All right, what, where, why isn't that working, and why aren't you telling me how to do it? Like, they're all the same game. They're all the same game. Which, maybe I'm being a hypocrite, because I've always been like, hey, if it's not broke, don't fix it. Just add some new cool shit. Like, the way they did from Crash Bandicoot 1 to Crash Bandicoot 2. Go see my Crash Bandicoot series for me to talk about that in more detail. Will you scan? Thank you. We found the key. Great. 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 I'm very happy. I'm very moved by whatever it is we're doing here with Stellar Blade. Stellar Big Booty Blade. All right. Yay! This is riveting. I'm having the time of my life. There definitely isn't five or six other games I'd rather be playing. I'll name them. Uh, RoboQuest. Uh, Final Fantasy 16. Warhammer Bolt Gun. What is that, three? Uh, we're doing Sly Cooper and the Thievius Raccoonus. I'm having a little bit of fun. So, four. Uh. 
Mm. Helldivers 2, 5. Um, I think I could even do you one more. I'm playing, uh, I can't even, Fantasy Star Online on the Xbox, and I'm halfway kind of having a good time. Like, I'm exhausted learning about it, which we know the first hours of those games are, but, like, the combat's pretty fun, the character design's pretty fun, it's like, I don't know. I'm not going to stream it, though. It's like, it's my Persona 5. Like, I just, just, I just want to play a game sometimes and not have to worry about talking and or, like, well, what will I say when I play it the second time? Don't worry, all the changes in Paper Mario and the Thousand Year Door are super obvious, and when going through it again, I'm going to be very like, oh, oh, oh. That's right where they pounded my mommy. What's a dropper doing there? What's a dropper doing there? Not petitioning on the internet to make me more naked. To expose my awesome Korean tits. Why don't you take a closer look? Ah, oh, Love cold ones o'clock. No, you didn't just hear that. <laughs> I swear I think she's starting to listen to some of my episodes now. You, you want to do an episode? This is the wrong game to have the, the GF on for the first time. We need to do like Mario something. <laughs> oh, she's going to do one. I might get her to record one like fucking next weekend or this weekend. I don't know. Our little one has a dance recital. Oh, uh, yeah, I like that. Remember, incels, you told me you won. I'm going to my daughter's recital Saturday. Uh, you guys are just going to be shitting your pants as your mom holds a fucking shitting toilet for you. You can't name three women in life that feel safe around you, family included. So, like, shut your goddamn mouth. You said the incels would never win, but we won! Hell of an entrance point back into an argument. Remember, I'm still safe on the ship, and you are the one risking your awesome, rocking, Korean ass. Loo-doo. Boo-doo. Why are people acting like this is the first game ever with, like, booby physics? There's literally a dead or alive volleyball game, folks. Well, this isn't new! I just, I fucking, I just fucking, I just, I, I hate you, you whiny little... Just every fucking day is a new thing to whine and complain about. Just shut up. I hate social media, man. I, I, I absolutely participate in it. But man, Thanos, he had the right idea, but hear me out. You snap half the people away, also snap away all social media, all future considerations for it, and everyone's memory of it. Imagine how much you would vastly change society. See, though, it does have some good uses, you know? All those videos of cops beating innocent people up has certainly helped. Uh, everything going on in Palestine, like, the one thing it does is it keeps the media somewhat honest. But, man, it's like, that's it. Everything else is awful. I just... I just remember growing up with my friends, man. Our, our video game conversations were like, hey, this game's fun. Cool. That game's fun, too. Neato, I should play it. Yeah, I should play your game, too. Cool. Like, that's what they were. We weren't yelling at people going, 
Yeah, well, Sony's stock is actually up 30% year over fiscal year. All right, this is not... This is not going well. Oh, fuck, I forgot it was a circle button. All right, we need that ring from Final Fantasy called Auto Dodge. All right, I hit the circle button, Mr. PlayStation controller. Also, this music rips. This is good. See, I'm being a good boy. I just was a good boy a little too late. She's like not dodging his attacks either. The one thing that annoys me with her and this game is is not that I suck at it, but like how it feels in between Devil May Cry and Elden Ring. You know what I mean? Like you're not quite as fast as Dante. Uh, but you're not as slow as like a FromSoft character. You know, you're just this weird in between. Like, I think the combat in From Software games feels kind of nice. Like, I swear to God, I've been playing Demon Souls at night, and I'm like vibing with it. I'm usually stoned as hell, dying a thousand times, but like getting a little bit better each time. And I think that's the whole thing of the game. But man. All right, I think I should use some of those grenades maybe. Like this in-between shit doesn't feel good is what I mean. Like either go full Dante or go full from soft. Like in ugh, it's like it's like when you can't commit. I'm going to die a few more times. And then uh, I just, because I'm assuming. All right, all right, all right. We sat up. Oh, dude. Oh. Look at you and your big stupid gorilla butt. I'm doing way better this time. Yeah. Yeah, you don't want the smoke. Wash Dad learned patterns. They taught me new tricks. All right, I'm going to wait. I'm going to hold on that. Oh, all right. Well, we did not. That was, we get an F for that one. Wait, I did, whoa, I did it. Oh, boy. Well, this certainly got harder, didn't it? Gee willikers. All right, never mind. This game rips. <laughs> we'll be keeping you. The only thing, I, I have Mario and the Thousand Year Door. I'm not going to buy it from Gamefly till I have to. But, uh... Oh, yeah.
Oh, you doofus! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Holy shit! Woo! Go me! Go wash dead! Go wash dead! Wash dead's the man, wash dead's the man who reproduced, wash dead did. Who reproduced, who reproduced, who beat that boss? Gigas, why did they name something after her boobs? Oh boy, please put a save point soon. <laughs> that would be really mean. Woohoo! Look at me! Hell yeah, no, this game rips. We're gonna beat it. You know what I need to do? I just need to have, like, a fucking four-hour session with the game and just really take a bite out of it. You can tell by looking at the screen. Core. Yeah, none of us, the audience, we don't know anything about that. I don't know what's going on. Earth looks like it was decimated by aliens, and now we're investigating it. Like, that's it. That's all I've pieced together. I've been furiously masturbating, and I'm a member of Free Stellar Blade. Ooh, a new beautiful ba? A new beautiful bride. Oh, she thick. <laughs> she looks stupid. There's like, give them a thick lower body, and then there's like, Jesus. Oh, maybe it's her sweatpants. All the androids in the future will be Korean, but have British accents. <laughs> Who would have programmed that into them? I guess whoever. Whoever ended up colonizing the most, I guess. We're in that hideout waiting for another squad to arrive for almost two years. And then we must act. Yes, I can so much to say for me. Still though, kudos to this studio. The only game, the games they made before this were cell phone games. Like, congrats. I hope this does well. You perverts got your naked lady back. Now go support the game. You know you will. Everyone who was like, it's about the gore. I'm like, uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> Girlfriend walks in on me masturbating. No, it's not the woman. It's the situation. Like... She's his teacher. What is it? Or whatever ones you fucking watch. There's another city where this voice actor uh, will get paid $20 an hour. Look at her strength. Her ass is gigantic. It's like funny. <laughs> I've already said this in several episodes. There's no way the 3D animator woman, man or not, wasn't like flicking the bean or yanking his chain. Both. So please help me save Zombie. If we do, I promise I'll call my I'm sorry folks, my generation, we had Rouge the Bat. It's about joining forces and helping. And y'all are bitching about this. My generation, we had Peach in Super Smash Brothers Melee. Cooperate or do not cooperate? How oh, cooperate? Yes. Thanks for teamwork. Uh, Princess Peach in Melee. If you kicked up, you could see her pink uh, uh, volleyball pants or whatever she was wearing. But they totally designed it. And I remember pausing and going, "Whoa, what's on the blurry porn channel?" I feel I've overshared, possibly. Gonna take a swig now of the White Claw Brew. Yeah, wherever that is. Cool. For sure.
I know what's going on. I'm very enthralled with the story and very into it. Can we can we get the Vadavas guy from Elden Ring to play this? By the by, once what, is that his name? You you all know who I'm talking about. He's like famous at this point. The guy who pieces together the FromSoft nonsense. Once I really got into Elden Ring and saw his videos, I was into the game a thousand percent more. Which, okay, man, why, why are you telling us that? I'm telling you that because if the game had somehow found a better way to do it rather than text through a thousand items and seeing how they're related, if just a few cutscenes and maybe a little bit of dialogue as you play someone giving exposition or narrative, maybe I would have been into... Like, folks, I picked up and put down Elden Ring like three or four times where I was just like, man... It wasn't even the get good. Like, I would just fucking, uh, I would grind XP and overlevel myself. So, the get good never applied. I mean, Margo, I, a few ch a few points, but I never quit because of that. I just quit. I was like, I'm bored. I'm like, what am I exploring? Who did I just kill? Like, why should I care? Wh what even is the Elden Ring? What's the big tree? Why is this area over here bleeding? Why is the big man on a small pony? Then I watched one of his videos explain it all. A few videos. And I was just like, oh my god. They should make this a goddamn TV show. Give me eight Game of Thrones based, like, writers. I mean, the writers from seasons one through six. <laughs> hey, I think seven's fine. Seven drop off is there but seven you know seven's like this c plus b minus fun fact about game of thrones i did not have the same 11 yearish wait <laughs> you all did every season i i binged it in december and the new season the last season eight came out in may so i binged it from you know, December to April, and I literally finished season seven the day before season eight, or maybe the day of. I had the season seven finale, and I was like, oh, I'm just going to watch this and go right into season eight. And I thought season eight, folks, I'm be honest, I thought season eight was fire the first time I watched it through. Like, I don't know why, but binging it and then getting to season eight, I was like, this is so cool. So then I rewatched Game of Thrones. <laughs> and immediately season one was like off putting. What do I mean? I mean like off puttingly good. I was like, whoa, wait a minute. Because, you know, a couple months went by. I saw the hate season eight was getting, and I'm like, I don't know. Like, you know, there's some plot points that are bad, but like it was entertaining. And. Yeah. When I rewatched it the second time through, I was like shocked. And I was like, oh, I don't know why that makes a difference. Someone explain that to me. Why did watching it all the way through a second time, like why didn't I notice the drop off? I have no idea. I have no idea. But I was like, oh, Wait, the writing and storytelling used to be very good. That's so crazy that they did that. Because they were all going to write the new Star Wars. <laughs> like, I'm sorry, like, aren't you under contracts? Like, you, you tell the Star Wars people, fuck off. Let me, let us finish this. Also, that guy hasn't finished his fucking book yet. George R. R. Martin. All right, I think Come on, we're almost done. this is a good point to save. <laughs> Where's a chair? Uh. Yay! <laughs> Yay! Uh. 
I don't get it. Oh. Yay. I mean, I'm just fucking hitting buttons, folks. I don't fucking know. <laughs> I, I really don't. I really don't. I refuse to learn. Oh, wow. I have two more SP since when? Ooh, ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. Um, should I do something with survival? Should we do something with our health? I don't know. Ugh. Makes it easier to use blink and repulse. Allows another dodge while dodging. Fuck yes. I don't even want to read the others. Fuck yes. Oh. All right. Well, this game's back in my good graces. Why can I not rest? Can uh, Did the game save? What the fuck? What the fuck are you? You look like a weird rooster with a small face. What is this? Look how she's dressed. This game wasn't horny enough for some of you? Whatever, we'll do the one more cutscene. I I'm I just don't want to save and not have this work. What the fuck? Let me start the introduction. Images beyond my worst nightmares. This is what the average free stellar blader blader looks like. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm laughing at my own joke, but come on. Just replace the books with laptops and whatever else you have in your Reddit death dungeons. He's literally the internet guy from that Aqua Teen Hunger Force episode. Oh, it said saving. Yay. All right. Next time on Free Stellar Babe, I continue to make fun of you that weren't horny enough for this game. <laughs>